is first to aid navigation, part of the tech vibration from prey in the water, and our small external ears give them a good sense of hearing, both above and below the water surface. Sea lions, like many marine mammals, can see well both above and underwater. They have a keen eyesight, but no color vision. In the wild, they inhabit water close to shores, flat rocky cliffs with typhoons, and a preference for rocky beaches. They have excellent climbing abilities and can please the scale rocky cliffs. What check that out? Swimming abilities, and let's start with Sandra. That's sexy, yes. Sea lions generally cross around 11 miles per hour using the rowing movement of their front flippers. While their back flippers are stretched out behind their bodies, functioning as rudders for steering. And that is their normal swim. Nice and easy. Thank you so much, Sandra. Predators are going to achieve a burst speed of up to 25 miles per hour! And that is surely a fast swim of the round of plus four ice is the previous! Whoa, nice flying at this! That's crazy. Oh, <laughs> now here's an interesting story about our sea lions. Did you know that the U.S. Navy has trained a few of them to take part in a special operation? Yes, that's right. They are able to hold their breath for up to 20 minutes and they can dive hundreds of feet. Abilities that even the best Navy diver would be envious of. And since they cannot be detected by radar underwater, they are tough to recognize and avoid underwater mines. <laughs> All right, girls, are you ready? Welcome! This time, could you please join our sea lion fans in a salute? And a count of three, everybody will salute. And let's make this one loud. So, guys, are you ready? I don't think so. Come on, are you ready? All right, let's start counting. One, two, three. Salute, everybody. Thank you so much. Well, sea lions are also used to search and recover equipment from the water. H2O water. Us, zip, trainers, paint, this, we have things. Got a dust and get those rings. Oh, they got it. How about another round of applause? This is Sandra. Oh, clap, clap, one more. Okay, what is next? We have the balls. How do you think they catch the balls? It's a ball balance. Get more girls. Wow. Almost there. Steady. And fantastic. Great balancing girls. Okay. All right. I think we've got everything. The balls and the rings, the rings and the balls, let's move on. In case you'd like to know, here at Manila Ocean Park, we have six South America. Okay, let's go. Why? Try some fish? Can I continue? Okay, as I was saying, here at Manila Ocean Park, we have... Maybe she wants to say something for her as well. What did she say? Sandra said we are not yet done and why? There's one more missing object. Are you sure, Sandra? Uh-huh. <laughs> Let me ask Isis first. Hey, Isis, is there one more? No more. <laughs> yeah. All right, to be fair, I'm gonna ask the audience. 
Hey guys, is there one more missing object? Are you sure? Really? Look you me, guys. It's so sad. Sandra, that's bad. Cut that out. If there's really one more missing object, could you please tell Isis what it is? Say, say. What? Akala ko meron. A water gun. Are you right, Sandra? Well, I think it's a mission for us to search for that missing toy gun. Let's go! Vamanos! It's time for Mission Impossible. Is it there, girls? Nothing will keep on searching. Don't scratch too hard, trainers. I said, keep on looking. We need to find the gun. Oh. Oh. Nice one, Isis. Keep on searching. Hmm, where is the toy gun to be? Any sign of it yet, trainer? Stop! This has been what keep on circuit. Come on, focus. Focus on your mission. Yeah, two ices. I said focus. Now the girls are playing around. Any updates? Huh? Yes, yeah, Sandra? Come on, tell us. Wow, what's that? Oh, she found it. Well, go ahead and prove it to us. Hey, Isis, can Sandra find it? No? Let's wait. And another one for Isis to cheer her up. Clap, clap, clap more. Come on. Clap, clap, clap more. It's okay, Isis. Better luck next time. Oh. <laughs> and now we've come to the part of the show where one of you will be able to meet Isis up close. If you're willing to volunteer, all you have to do is to raise your hand. And we're gonna choose one. I need an adult female. An adult female, come on. While well, waiting for luck, guess in case Go you'd on. like to know. Here are better, let's go. How about a round of applause for our lucky guest, Miss Sabrina from Spain? Go ahead. Take her way to train Eric and Isis. Alright, mom, question. Is it your first time meeting a train sea line of close? First time? Full of flipper shake is always appropriate. Hold Isis flipper. Look at the camera and give your best smile. Isis, is that a smile? Ready. Okay, Miss Sabrina. It's time for you to feed Isis. You gotta feed her. Okay? Alright, step back to Isis, please. Here at the edge. Come on. Then stop. Face Isis and right palm up. And trainer Eric will give you a slice of fish. Set your and can you go back, please? Alright. Sabrina, listen. In a count of three, you are going to toss that fish to Isis just like trainer Eric. Just like that. So easy, right? But if Isis won't be able to catch it, you are so lucky. You know why? Because you are going to swim with them for free! Is that okay, Sabrina? Alright, you volunteered for this. That's right. Are you ready? Now let me count. One, two, three, dozen! Oh no! Isis didn't catch it. Miss Sabrina, 
We had a deal, right? Uh oh. Now, you go to the edge. Fair Eric will assist you. Yeah. Okay, in the count of three, we're going to swim to the pool. I'll come first, alright? Okay. Help me out, everybody. Let's come for her. Ready? One, two, three. Jump into the pool. Show them all the water by Sandra. 
shake your booties. Come here and shake it well. Shake it, shake it. Yeah. You know. Keep on. Show them what you got. And Arriba! And for the big knowledge. Steady! And we also hope that even after you leave, you'll stay experience with you wherever you go. And remember, what we do here on land greatly affects our friends in the sea. Sea lions, like many animals, cannot survive in tropical environment, so let's keep our surroundings clean. Aside from pollution, there are many other threats to survival all over the world, such as climate change and illegal hunting. You can learn more about this inside Ocean Arena. Always keep in mind what a steward of our planet and us. Each one of us must do what we can to protect and conserve all the inhabitants of our Mother Earth, including ourselves. So on behalf of Trainer Eric and Isis, Trainer Essel and Sandra, and all of Quarica and Manila Ocean Park, we would like to thank you all for visiting us today. Have a great day, guys. We'll see you there.